What's the difference between PNS Substrate Sauce and PNS ProBio? The freshwater and marine aquarium communities are just now starting to learn what aquaculturists such as fish and shrimp farmers have known for decades, how easily PNS bacteria may be used to promote a healthy and stable captive aquatic environment. Most interestingly, these microbes can be tailored for specific uses simply by cultivating them on certain types of growth media. The biologists at Hydrospace have taken advantage of this to develop two very different products, namely PNS Substrate Sauce and PNS ProBio. In this video, we describe these differences so you can select the most appropriate product for your specific purpose. Wall Pro Bio was developed first, is for more general use, and is indeed our more popular product. We'll begin here with the discussion of substrate sauce, which is specially formulated for cycling and conditioning new systems. We should note here right away that substrate sauce is cultured in salt water and therefore is even more specifically formulated for marine systems. Substrate sauce contains live cultures of two PNS bacteria species, Rhodopseudomonas palustris and Rhodospirillum rubrum. While similar, the two species each prefer slightly different microhabitats, foods, etc., and thus contribute more ecological biodiversity as a pair than as individuals. Even more importantly, substrate sauce is cultured on a mineral medium that includes inorganic sources of nitrogen, specifically ammonium bicarbonate. This adapts the cell to utilize ammonia, which is of course most commonly seen in excess during the early stages of aquarium maturation. Moreover, substrate sauce purposefully contains a small excess of phosphate. At one full dose, this elevates phosphate concentration by approximately 0.05 parts per million. Wait, why would you want to add phosphates to your new tank? Consider that most modern cycling techniques, especially clean, fishless cycling does not account for the phosphorus requirements of your bacteria. PNS bacteria, nitrifying bacteria, and indeed all bacteria need phosphate to survive and proliferate. PNS substrate sauce includes a supplemental boost of bioavailable phosphorus that allows them to thrive. Finally, because the live microbes in substrate sauce are cultured in marine conditions, they adjust and begin to grow very quickly in your reef tank. PNS ProBio, on the other hand, is cultured in freshwater. This makes it appropriate for use in both freshwater and marine systems. ProBio is a monoculture of Rhodopseudomonas palustris, but it differs more markedly from substrate sauce in that it is cultured on an organic growth medium. Specifically, it is grown on an aquatic plant-based tea that is rich in cellulose, tannins, polyphenols, and other poorly degradable compounds. What this means is that these cells are adapted to consume the very same substances in your pond or aquarium, including detritus and yellowing compounds that most other bacteria cannot consume. As extraordinary as ProBio's capacity to break down the recalcitrant organic wastes is, its greatest value to aquarists is as a food and food additive. For example, one can add it to a fish food where it has demonstrated ability to increase feed conversion rates. That is, these probiotic microbes allow their fish host to digest and assimilate more of the food it eats. Consequently, the host grows faster and generates less waste. Research shows that PNSB are specifically beneficial for digestion in herbivorous fish such as rabbit fish, which consumes substantial amounts of cellulose-rich turf algae and macroalgae. Bacteria constitute the bulk of many corals' diets. Rhizobial bacteria such as the PNS bacteria in ProBio are favored by, and indeed even selectively ingested, by corals. This is not only because PNS bacteria are protein-rich and contain healthful carotenoids, but also because they form important symbiotic associations with the coral and its zooxanthellae to create recyclable, bioavailable forms of nitrogen. So let's quickly review all of the major differences between PNS substrate sauce and PNS ProBio. 1. Substrate sauce contains Rhodopseudomonas and Rhodospirillum, whereas ProBio is a monoculture of Rhodopseudomonas. 2. Substrate sauce is specially formulated for marine application, whereas ProBio may be used in both freshwater and marine systems. 3. 
Substrate Sauce is cultured on mineral media, including an inorganic nitrogen source, making it more appropriate for use in actively cycling systems. ProBio is cultured on certain herbal media that make it more appropriate for consuming organic wastes in mature systems. 4. Substrate Sauce contains supplemental phosphate which, again, makes it most appropriate for cycling. ProBio, on the other hand, is phosphate-free. Sure, both products make for an excellent food and both consume ammonia, nitrate, phosphate, and organics. But by taking advantage of the unique characteristics of each, the user can maximize their results. For marine aquarists, this is as simple in practice as using substrate sauce during the cycle and then regularly using ProBio afterward. It's even simpler for freshwater aquarists who may use ProBio exclusively from the cycle onward. We hope this video helps you to understand the distinct advantage of each of these products. For more information on PNS bacteria, including direct links to corroborative peer-reviewed literature, please visit our blog at www.hydraspace.store.